Welcome to your client card. This is a client record in Visita that gives you a 360 degree view of all client info and activity at a glance. It contains all the information you need to perform services for and interact with your clients. The client card has three panels. This is a client information panel. It contains important information that you need to complete services. The tag section lists all the tags associated with the client. Tags are used to group and filter client segments in your client list. In the staff section, you will see the primary staff associated with the client and the additional staff underneath. The primary staff is the main point of contact for the client. The most recent note on the client appears below. Finally, you will see the activity highlights like an upcoming booking, payment summary, and any packages that the client purchased. We'll see the client activity in more detail in just a few moments. The contact information panel is where the client's email, phone number, address, and other pieces of contact information are stored. You will also find credit cards saved on file, if any. Click show more to show advanced details such as the client's time zone. Finally, you will find all the items or individuals nested under the main contact in the bottom right of the client card. You can also add one using the plus button. In this case, there are multiple projects associated with this contact. Click the edit icon in either panel to edit any of the stored information. This is a client activity panel where you'll find the entire client history. The conversation pane contains all of your interactions in a single ongoing thread. Staff interactions appear on the right-hand side, while client interactions appear on the left. Page through the individual tabs to see activity of a specific type, like notes, bookings, payments, and documents. You decide what information to store on the client card and how to collect it through client fields and intake forms. Configure the settings under Client and Contact Info. You will find a list of client and contact fields that currently appear on the client card and your intake forms. To create a new one, click on one of the Add buttons depending on the type of information you are trying to collect. Is this a piece of contact information like a phone number or address or unique ID? Create a contact field. Any other general information can be added as a client field. We want to collect a secondary phone number, so let's add a contact field. Give your new field a name. Now you can add it to your intake forms. Vasita gives you three intake forms, a booking form, a payment form, and a contact or leave details form. Select all the forms you want to add it to. Enable this checkbox if it's a required field. If required, clients will not be able to submit the form without filling out this field. The display until filled out option doesn't make the field required, but it will keep appearing on the intake forms until your client fills it out. It's ideal for information that would be nice to have, but is not mandatory, like a secondary phone number. Add the field. The new field is added to the bottom of the list. The order that the fields are displayed in this list is the same order in which they will appear on the intake forms. Let's move this up one under the primary phone number. Now that we have all the client and contact fields we want to collect, let's take a look at our intake forms. As mentioned, Vasita gives you three forms and you can preview each one by clicking on the preview buttons. The intake form you will probably be using the most is the scheduling form. It appears during the booking process and is used to collect information from clients booking your services. You will see all the fields that we added to this form listed here. If you want to add more, return to the Client Fields tab and add more or edit existing fields to add them to the scheduling form. Every form also has a policy section where you can add a business policy to display to the client before they submit the form. Similarly, you can adjust the leave details form and payments form. 
Clients fill out the leave details form when they fill out a contact form or send your business a new message. The payment form is filled out when submitting a payment. Forms are skipped if the client is logged in as an existing client, so they don't have to enter their information over and over again. After filling out any form, a new client card with all the collected information will be added to the client's list in Visita. You'll notice that all contact fields appear on the right hand side, like our secondary phone number. The client fields appear on the left. There are plenty more great features in store for you. Keep watching to find out. To learn more, visit our help center at support.visita.com.